Alcoa kicked off what's expected to be a rocky earnings season on Wall Street. The aluminum giant beat analyst profit expectations, strong demand for metal from China, and the aerospace industry boosted Alcoa's bottom line. Investors will get earnings report cards later today from BlackBerry maker Research in Motion, Bed Bath & Beyond, and Ruby Tuesdays. Concerns about weak earnings kept investors on the sidelines Tuesday. The Dow Industrials up nearly five points. The Nasdaq Composite gained more than eight on the day. The government is predicting a little less pain at the pump. In its annual summer gasoline outlook, the Energy Department says gas will average a few cents less than last summer, about $2.81 a gallon. That's thanks to lower crude oil prices. Oil also back at the spotlight today. Traders are waiting for the latest report on oil stockpiles. And no pay, no play. That's what some heavy metal bands are saying after Ozzy Osbourne decided to turn OzFest into FreeFest, making tickets free and not paying performers. Touring has become the salvation of many bands as CD sales continue to fall. And so far, only third-tier bands have reportedly signed on to headline the show. Osbourne says the show is great exposure to new audiences, but some bands seem to be worried about playing for free for an audience that's largely given up on buying CDs. That's your Money Watch. Log on to CBSNews.com for more business headlines. In New York, I'm Alexis Christophorus.